So in this video, I thought I'd show you how you can make animated maps for games like Daisy. You might have seen maps like these used by Frankie on PC or other YouTubers. So let's get to it. First up, you'll want to download the map I've included in the description. This is a massive image of the Daisy map and then it's got all the towns named. Then you want to go into Photoshop, create a new image, 1920 by 1080 Then you'll want to drag the map in. And then once the map's in, we're just going to resize it so we get the area we want to include in our animated map. Here it is. Alright, I am going to have the Northwest Airfield in the top left. So I'll just finish resizing this. There we go. That looks good to me. Then we'll just let this resize. It takes quite a while because it's 16 by 16,000. It's a pretty huge image. So I'm just going to save this in my project folder, which I've put into here. And we'll name this Daisy Map or something of the sort save this as a PNG. That's pretty much the best format in terms of quality. So now you want to open up After Effects, then drag over the daisy map we just created to the project file. Now put this down on the timeline, making sure it starts as zero. Then we're going to create a new shape layer. Then select the pen tool up at the top, because you can use this to make nice curved lines. So I'm going to make a curved line here, going up to the right hand corner of the map. Then on shape layer, to get dash lines, you want to go to contents, shape, then stroke. Then for dash size, I usually use 40. I think that looks pretty good. You get nice big dashes like you see in other videos. Then you want to minimize this. Go back up here, go to add. Then you want to add a trim path. Then go down on your trim path options and keyframe both start and end. So then you're going to make them both zero at the start. Then drag it to about four seconds. I think that's a pretty good time. Then make end to 100. So then you can see it's filling up there. Kind of scanning over to the right hand side. So that's the animated map with the dashes. Then you can just add it to the render queue. Then render it out. So I'll do that now. I want to go to file. Then export. Add to render queue. Now here's your render queue. You can select where you want to output it to. I'm outputting it to documents, calling it daisy map. So then you want to hit render and then it will be done. You'll have your animated line going up to the right hand side or any map you've chosen. So thanks for watching the video. In the next one, I'll be showing you how to add a vehicle at the front of the line using keyframing. So if you want to see that, then hit like and it should be up in a couple of days. Thanks for watching.